A Tennessee native and U.S. Army four-star general lost his life last week. General Carl Steiner was a pillar in the development of the U.S. Special Forces. And reporter Caitlin Keenahan shares how he was also a pillar in the community. East Tennessee hearts rested inside the First Baptist Church of La Follette today. And I'm proud to be an American. The community paid their respects to an American legend. And I won't Four-star U.S. Army General Carl Steiner. You know, words can't express. Uh, you know, the honor, the legacy, what he did for our great for our great country uh, should never be forgotten. General Richard Clark flew into East Tennessee to honor a mentor. He's the 12th commander of U.S. Special Operations, and General Steiner was the second. To, to follow in a man's footsteps like General Steiner is a great honor. We just wanted to come out to let the kids see um, that big heroes can come from small towns. You don't get many of those people in your hometown, and you don't get many of those people nationwide. In La Follette, I'm Caitlin Keenahan. Steiner served 35 years in the U.S. Army during the Vietnam War and Desert Storm. He eventually retired in 1993 and returned home to Campbell County.